What is up everyone, this is Mo Gaming here, and today I'm going to show you how to fix the Xbox Series X or S or Xbox One error code 0x8B0500B6 in 2024. So let's get right into this. So this is like an overall network error code that basically happens when you're trying to like play online or just even ask YouTube or whatever, right stuff, it doesn't matter, whatever it is, some way, shape or form online and this error basically pops up. So there's a few things you can do to fix this. The first thing is you want to go to settings and you want to always make sure that you have the latest system console update available. As you can see, I have no console update available. My console is up to date. So that's a good thing to kind of make sure to always do. The other thing you can always do is you can always like kind of press into the Xbox button uh, on your thing and just sign out and sign back into your Xbox account. Sometimes there's always issues with the Xbox account itself and signing in and out usually helps fix this issue. Uh, the other thing you can do is you want to go to general, you want to go into network settings, and in here, the first thing is you want to look at that right hand side where it says under NAT type open, all services available, it kind of checks to make sure that you are, like there's no network error or like a system update happening or a server update I should say happening, right? So once you confirm that, you want to do set up wireless internet connection. It's going to ask you to choose a connection over here and then just choose, preferably if you can do wired, always go for wired because that's always the more preferable thing to do if you can't that's fine but it's always preferable to go for a wired connection once you're in here you want to hover over to where it says dns settings and you want to change it from automatic into manual so right now i have 8.8.8.8 for primary and i have 8.8.4.4 for secondary which is google's dns settings that you can basically have once you've done this it'll successfully connect you should be then good to go it'll check your connection status it'll say all oh, good connect to the internet and that's basically it and you're good to go so yeah, doing this, restart your console, you should be good to go. You should not have this error persist any longer. So yeah, that's basically it. If you guys still have any comments, questions, or concerns, let me know in the comments section below. More than you guys up. If you guys are over this video, please smash that like on the side. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell. I'm going to go.